everyone so I have a haul video for you today so I have uh, some bits here from basically the last couple of months ish uh, if you guys may or may not know uh, but me and uh, three other beautiful ladies Grace Alice and Zoe uh, whenever one of us is in a craft shop or is going to do an online order we always kind of check if any, any of us wants to kind of throw some bits in and that's basically what we've been doing since the last time we see each other which was in February um, and then we went and see each other uh, yesterday we went into London and did a little bit of shopping and then the girls obviously handed me some bits that I'd bought through them a few weeks ago so I have quite a pile of stuff here so i'm going to try and remember what shops each thing come from we did go to kiki k paper chase and tiger when we were out um and then i've got a few other shops here as well so i'm going to start with hobbycraft hobbycraft um alice was doing an order on hobbycraft this was quite a few months ago now they had three for two on their craft tools or something on those lines um so i ended up getting a couple of bits that i was had my eye on so the first thing i have here is this i think pretty much every crafter ever has got this uh but i haven't had one and uh, i've been doing a lot more kind of mixed media scrapbook um videos and i've had to wait between uh between when the paint was drying so if you don't know this is a heat tool um, basically you just it's like a giant hair dryer really yes it looks very rude um, but yes it is a heat tool and so when you're doing painting or something you can just um, use it to dry the layers so I got one of those they are that's about nine ninety nine or about ten pounds and then I got this. I go through alphabet stickers like they're going out of fashion. Um, I have to buy them on a monthly occasion when I'm doing all the scrapbook layouts. So I bought this. It is the We Are Memory Keepers mini alphabet punch board. Um, so you, I found out from Alice you actually have an app that you can use with it for your phone. So I'm going to try this out. I may do a tutorial or some sort of walkthrough video with this um, on how to use it once I've figured it out. Uh, but yes, so I got that as well. Then from the website uh, Every Crafts A Pound, sporadically they have um, some really really good bits like uh, a couple of weeks ago or a couple of well a month or so ago uh, Alice was on there and she see that they had some first edition paper pads on there I knew that there were three there were four paper pads that I really really wanted as an order and uh, got me some copies of them as well so the first paper pad I have here is this one it is the Belle and Boo 6x6 design paper pad. There's uh, two glitter designs and two UV designs. I'm guessing that's like embossed. So I will quickly go through these. So this one is just a butterfly design. There's a couple of that design. Then there's a floral, floral glittery one. I hope you can see that. And then there's a bunny one. This is really gorgeous kind of purple and then there's this really beautiful floral there's this one with the little bunny playing with the butterfly on so cute then this one with the little girl on really pretty the stripes and the coordinating colors bunny playing again sorry i'm not in shot just some spots and then this gorgeous turquoise one with the floors on are beautiful and a pale pink and then the one that's the other way around is just this boxed one so i can't i don't really know how much these were i think this one was about a pound two pound not quite sure but really really cheap so there's that one 
The next paper pad I have here is called Sail Away. It is from First Edition Paper. Uh, I've obviously got into this, so I've had to take the tape off. I really hate that tape, it just rips the front of it. So we have, this is a 6 by 6 again, there's uh, two embossed, two fabric texture ones and again two spot UV. So this one's a textured one so you have the little houses on. I like the little, tiny little pops of colour that are in that one. And then there's this one which just has like the anchors, sun, sand, really kind of beach themed one. Then you have this one which is lighthouses. Oh, I really like the colour of them. So that and then this one which is fish and chips. Really like that. I really like I could probably use that um when me and my mum go for chips uh at the chip shop mainly on a weekly basis. This one which has the kind of boat nut knots on and this is very textured. It feels if you can hear that, it feels amazing. You can kind of see on the back how textured it is. So there's that one, there's this one. Again, I think this is another textured one that just has like loads of pebbles on. This one that has boats. Oh wait, no, we've missed one. This one that has all the kind of beach huts and stuff. Then we have the boats. And then we have the little fishies and also the fishy one is uh, double-sided. So this has waves on the back as well. This one has the sunglasses on and then the back is just, it almost looks like torn paper. Then we have the anchors and then anchors on the other side. We have the uh, starfish and then on the reverse of that it's just a grey scale with a uh, little white starfish on. And then we have some belts and the reverse is just a red dot and then there's this one that has like those little flags on and this one that's the reverse of it is this turquoise with the spots we have seashells and then just a curved on the back and then birdies and then the reverse is just more birds so there's that paper pad the next one is this one. This one's called Kaleidoscope. This is the 8x8 one, again by First Editions. The first, there's just so many gorgeous sheets. There's this one, striped, this beautiful one with glitter on. This one that just has this beautiful purples. Just some gorgeous, gorgeous patterns in here. So, so pretty. This just reminds me of when I had one of those, you know those telescope things that had the kaleidoscope, um, just the kaleidoscopes. <laughs> um, just some of these patterns just reminds me of my childhood because there's just so many beautiful patterns in here. So gorgeous, look at those. They're just, everything is just beautiful. So I got that one. And the next one, you've probably seen this one. I did get this in the six by six, but I wanted it uh, in the eight by eight as well. And I ran planning on getting this in the 12 by 12 because I absolutely love this paper pad so much. Um, I've already used some of these 6x6 six six that I've got, but I've been kind of holding off because I love these so much. Um, so I'm not going to go too in detail with this one because I have shown this before on this channel. But there are just some beautiful patterns in here. Some are glittered, some are foil, uh, some are glittered, some are embossed, some are slightly textured. Oh, this is so beautiful. Absolutely love this paper pad. So there's one of those as well. 
on to the Kiki K stuff. So I have a few bits here that the lovely Grace put in her Kiki K order for me. And I have some bits here that we picked up when we actually went into Kiki K yesterday. Uh, into the new one that's in King's Cross. So yeah, I will show you these bits. So the first thing I picked up uh, yesterday when I was in King's Cross was actually this planner kit. It is from the creative range and this was 50% uh, off I have just taken it out of the packaging because it's just easier to show so in here this is for a personal they did have it in um, an A5 but I'm more in my personal so um, you get two washi tapes in here and you get obviously two uh, little love heart uh, paper clips uh, and then you and then there's um, two of these cards that just have some inspirational things on um, and then a ruler that will just clip into your planner there's then this which I'm really excited for it's just a little pocket that goes in and you can put little bits in then there's two there's two sheets of stickers so you have kind of the tab ones some more kind of inspirational ones and some circles and stuff so there's those and then there's this kind of acetate dashboard and then an extra little pocket that will go in your planner as well so all that i think was I think it was about £4.50. Um, it's normally more than that, obviously, but it was in the sale. So there's that. These, again, I've taken them out of, pack out of the packaging just to show you. But they are just these kind of puffy stickers. Oh, they're so beautiful. Um, they have, you have like the stationery on and the birds and, oh, just prettiness. So there's those. Then I picked up this little notepad that just has my name on, uh, just has a G on. I'd love it if I had my name on, but it just has a G on. And then the paper inside is quite thick and it just has a little G at the top and it says a note for you. And then Kiki K at the bottom, but yes, absolutely love that. I picked up this pen, which is just pale pink. This is from the letters range. Um, it's one of their gel pens it's just oh they write so smoothly i'm addicted to these pens now uh so i got one of those and the last thing i picked up myself was this this is the paper lovers book from the letters range um it has um, it has a few other ranges in here as well. So I'll do a really, really quick flick through for you. So you, at the beginning you have just some paper, obviously, to write letters, which is with this range. There's then an envelope, another envelope, another envelope, patterned paper. Then there's mini greetings cards with the envelopes to put them in. So we thought that was really fun. There's a gift bag there, a page of stickers, a box, so that's the lid and that's the base. There's then more stickers. There's then some cards that kind of fold up a little bit differently. More stickers, more stickers, uh, more cards or postcards in here some tags uh, a pencil that you can make up the 3d one more punch out things then there's this range which i think is the cute range um and then you have some patterned paper and some um things to make bits so there's a box here stickers there's cards postcards tags more stickers and then there's this range which i don't remember the name of it it's very brown um which i was not quite keen on um you have envelopes and stuff you have some foiling foiling in here which does help it you can make like a little diamond thing i really like this banner so you have all the letters to make a banner i was thinking of making like mr and mrs or something for a wedding page or something like that but there's those 
and then you have some wrapping paper in the back so yeah this is normally about 18 pounds and i got it for nine so it's really good plus it's on the three for two as well in there so definitely go check out kiki k um and then on to what grace picked me up um in the sale when she did a kiki k order so the first thing she picked up for me was this sticker book and this was from this is from the creative range so i'll do a quick flick through this so it's just a sticker book and then you have some inspiring quotes some just round stickers, some more quotes, loads of foiling in here and the circles, you have some kind of letter tags, some washi strips, some photo corners, some tags. So yeah, so that is the sticker book. Uh, there was then this, which is the sticker book for the letters range so there's so many cute cool bits in here so there's them ones and the pencils round ones scalloped scalloped edges should i say uh some of the um to and from stickers and washi strips and photo corners and then tags in the back so there's that one and then the last uh, then there's this one which is the creative book uh, or the paper lovers book for the um creative range so they didn't have put loads of they didn't put loads of um ranges in here they literally just did the creative range so there's some cool bits i really like the flowers and you can make your own um paper tassels cake toppers just some patterned paper you have some alpha stickers in here which always come in handy some washi strips some more stickers at the bottom there a gift box some inspirational cards you can make a mobile and then you have like a, a bookmark in the back so there's that one and then the last thing she picked me up in that sale were these they are the uh, gel pens again there's a pack of three i think these are around three pounds and they're normally about six so i'm definitely set for kiki k gel pens now these should last me a while so I got those. And then the last thing that Grace picked me up, bless her, she, I think she got this from Hobby Craft. I can't remember where she got this from. Um, but she see these and thought of me, bless her. They are the Pink Paisley Oh My Heart Puffy stickers. Just like the cool mum. I will be cutting that to, for the, how you spell it in the UK, M-U-M. Um, but there's just some lovely bits on here. I really like this one, which is a phone. It says love ya and then XOXO. Me and my mum text like that all the time. Um, the good life, some florals and stuff. Just some beautiful, beautiful stickers. So thank you, Grace, for those. They're absolutely stunning. So that was those. And then we went into Paper Chase. And obviously, when you walk into Paper Chase in Tottenham Court Road, there was about four or five shelves or island things full of sale stuff so we went a little bit crazy so the first thing i picked up was this pen part it's this gorgeous kind of white metal and it has butterflies all over it um it was originally five pounds it was then by the looks of it knocked down to three pound fifty and then reduced to two pound fifty which is what i paid uh it needs a good clean um because obviously it's been on the shelf and it's a little bit dusty and stuff but i needed a new pen pot i needed a new white pen pot um this one that i have here is absolutely rammed with pens and i need to sort through them all so i thought if i bought a pretty new pen pot i would have an excuse to sort them out you can hope anyway so i got that then they had a new range in there 
which was all on sale and I've never seen it before and even Grace said she'd never seen it before um so I'm really sorry if you can hear that banging the kids are upstairs with their dad apparently tidying their room but whether that's actually happening I don't know um so yes so this was a range and it had loads of um, hot air balloons in as well so as soon as the girls see it grace see it and kind of waves me over um so yes yeah, so there was the washi tapes these are originally eight pounds and they can stay eight pounds if i can't get them out um so yeah so these are originally eight pounds it actually has like a blade if you can i don't know if you can see that there that's really strange i've never seen it on the washi tape so i don't think i'll be keeping it in here even though this is supposed to be like a makeshift washi tape thing um but there's this one just this i think i think the gist is that you know that that won't be happening so there's some really cool washi tapes in here i'm just going to destroy the box destroy the box to get them all out there you go so there you go here's a better look at the washi tapes so there's this one which just has a kind of black and white design on then there's this one which is turquoise and it just has some florals on then there's this one that's white and it just has a blue and pink floral design on then there's this one which is purple and it has hot air balloons on which i think is my favorite one then there's this one which has a kind of boat design it has like a little building on and stuff so there's that one there's this one which is just green and it has like hot air balloons and stuff on and then there's this one which just has some blue stripes on and then finally there's this one which just has some buildings and stuff on so they were £5.50 and there's what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight washi tapes. So you can't really go wrong with that. So I got those. The next thing I got from the same range, again, no idea where it's from. These were £3 knocked down to two. I think all of us picked up one of these, I think um so there's like this floral design there's this random dog which i don't really know where that's from another one some more animals and stags some florals these roses are beautiful more florals and then this little house then this woman who's in multiple different colours, some more florals and then obviously can you tell why I fell in love with this kit? Look how cool that is! Some beautiful vintage hot air balloons. So all that for £2 is just a bargain so I picked those up, throwing them all over myself. Those also from that range i picked these up i picked two up because you don't just things disappear at a paper chase so this is the refill pads these are uh were originally four pound but it was not down to two pound 80. i'll just show you the one because you don't need to see both i really like the back back has this really beautiful design on so when you're finished i'm thinking dashboard but yeah this just has some beautiful lined paper on it has the hot air balloon at the top there and then the florals with the hot air balloon there and it's just some beautiful lined paper so i bought two of those i then went a lot crazy in the reduced section i love this paper this kind of white uh, rose paper from American Crafts. It is what range is this? Doesn't actually say, but this is American Crafts paper. It just has this beautiful white roses on. I think you've probably seen this before. Um, the reverse is just black, but I bought it for this side for wedding scrapbooking. They had so many sheets of this in Paper Chase um, on sale, but yes, 
absolutely love this. I bought five of these and they were 75p each. So I got those. And then the last thing I picked up in there were these. A lot of their wedding stuff was on sale. A lot of it's like the decorations we can't have. We're not allowed anything hanging from the ceiling. So it's kind of limited us with decoration. So uh, we found these, these uh, Mr. and Mrs. signs. Oh, I'll go around. Um, they are originally uh, £3.50, but I got them for £2.50. Even though it says £3.50 there, and then on the front it says this is originally £5, and then it's £2.50. No idea. But the, we really wanted signs like this anyway, and I kind of thought with them being on sale, it, it's worth picking them up. So we picked, I picked those up. So that's everything I got um, recently, either from other people buying through them or from the shopping trip yesterday. Oh my god, it was so much fun. We had such a laugh yesterday. Zoe, Grace and Alice, you're amazing. I will link them all below their Instagram slash YouTubes. Um, but yes, make sure you go check out the girls. But yeah, thank you for watching this video, guys. And I'll see you all in my next one. Bye.